Hey there, it's Lance with Love to Hate, back again with another unboxing video. This time I'm going to be showing you the new game, Summer Camp. This is uh, from Buffalo Games and Puzzles. It is a Phil Walker Harding game, and if you are familiar with him, he has created such classics as Gizmos and Emotep. So really excited to see what his newest game is like. This is a new one that just released at Target. Uh, if you're here in the States, you can go ahead and get that. Uh, and uh, this is a deck building game, uh, pretty uh, a, a, uh, entry level into deck building as I understand it. And so i uh, excited to try this out with Sam and see what she thinks. So let's go ahead and open this up uh, on the back here. You can read the see the sides here or the back cover here. It says summer camp. Find your cabin assignment assignment. Uh, ring out your swimsuit and relive the days of canoeing, friendship, bracelets and s'mores. Summer Camp is a competitive deck building game where players race to earn merit badges and collect the most experience points to win. Each player has their own deck of cards to play, and as the game progresses, you will add new cards to your deck to make it even stronger. But look out, other campers have the same goal. Every game of Summer Camp is different. Compete for merit badges in various activities, adventure, arts and crafts, cooking, friendships, uh, games, outdoors or water sports. Choose three camp activities to play for in each game. The combination of these activities will change how your whole camp experience will play and fill. Zip lines, tetherball, fire making, tie dyeing, it's all here, right down to the very right down to the last boondoggy. Devise your strategy, build the best card combination to outplay your opponents and rule the summer as the ultimate camper. And so, as you heard me read there, there are uh, several decks that you're going to include uh, or have the choice of including. You'll pick three of them each time you play. And our rule book here is quite large. Does fit in the box though. It's not going to get bent or anything like that. Uh, nice large color pictures. And it's not a very thick rule book. I think this is a fairly easy game to understand. Sorry, it's kind of hard to get all of this book on frame here. And even an activity card reference here in the back of the book. So that's very nice. And then the way this game works, you've got these different uh, deck tuck boxes here that you can store the cards and tokens in. I'm not going to open each single one of these, but I will show you the base pack here. So you have your deck of cards here. And inside of these deck boxes, you also have some merit badge tokens that you are trying to compete for and these are nice guys these these tokens are really nice uh, they've got a uv finish to them so that's really cool and you just store everything back in these tuck boxes which i'll have to figure out how to get those back in there the right way uh, but as you can see here you do have all the different types of merit badges that you can try to compete for in each game. Now, you, like I mentioned earlier, you only pick three of these per game. So you might pick these three for one game and a different three for your next game. All right, let's see here. We've got some tiles. So let me open these off frame. Now these tiles make up the playing board for the game here. And uh, this is one that, that flips out like so, like that and it forms the top part of the playing area. And then uh, you're going to lay that on the board. And I apologize for the awkward filming angle here, but uh, you're going to place three of these together like so to form little raceway paths uh, with different action symbols at the top of these paths. And you're trying to move your little meeples down the different paths uh, trying to get to the finish line and there's going to be three paths for the three different decks that you're playing with in the game. So this is a bit of a race game as it is a deck builder.
And then let's take a look at our meeples up here. You do get three meeples in each player color. These meeples are pretty nice. They're campers. As you can see, the backpack on them there. That's pretty cool. Red, blue, purple, and yellow are our player colors. And we've got some snack bar tokens. These are just simple tokens here. Everything comes pre-punched in this game. You don't have to punch anything out. That's nice. No worries about not punching out cleanly and ripping the tiles. Uh, here's our starting or starting camper uh, patch, and it is just as shiny as the other ones are. That's pretty cool. And camper all star patch worth eight points. I think that's to the first player who can get all three of their campers across a bridge. The participation two point patch. Uh, there we'll have to read all the rules on how these play and then our player boards are pretty nice these are thick uh, thick cardboard here and so very detailed where your badges go your discard pile your draw pile that's pretty nice even where to store your energy tokens there so very nice all right that's all there is to this one that is summer camp from Buffalo Games and Puzzles and Phil Walker Harding. I'm excited to get this one out there and explore deck building with Sam. That's not one that we've gotten into a whole, whole lot, uh, but uh, this should be a good one to uh, crack that open. So uh, check out our videos that we do on this in the near future. I'm Lance. This is Love to Hate, where we try to bridge the gap between gamers and non-gamers. We'll catch you next time.